Hi, my name is Jessica and I'm an artist and today we're going to draw a crumpled paper towel. So I'm actually going to use a real paper towel as reference, as you should. So you crumple up your paper towel, set it down, and basically you're going to see that the paper towel has different shading and different crumples in it which make it a crumpled paper towel. Mine, as you can see, is kind of crumpled like this, so this is what I'm going to be drawing. So we're going to start with the bottom going to come up, come to a point at the top, and come back down. So we're just going to do the basic shape at first. There's one side of it here. It comes up and there's a fold and some crinkles here. And then it comes back. It folds here and it folds again down here. Now we're going to go in and illustrate some of the bigger crinkles that we see that really stand out. And so there they are. When I look at the paper towel, those are the crinkles that I see really standing out. You can add a few in too. Take artistic liberty here. Now, this is the fun part, or the more challenging part. We're gonna go in with another color of marker, preferably gray or black or what have you, and we're gonna draw the low lights. So basically trace the area underneath these different wrinkles and find the shadows, because that's what's going to really make that wrinkle in the paper towel stand out. And so we've got a couple here, a couple crumples, just like that. But other than that, it's really pretty easy. If you just wanted to do like a basic paper towel that has just a few crumples in it, you can also just kind of do it like that. Just bring it up on the sides, bring a few lines in. Don't forget to shade them in a little bit. If you want to fold it, you can do that. Crumple it up, just like that. And that is how you draw a crumpled paper towel.